You work for the black market, eh? Possibly other stuff out there, but I'm gonna go check over here instead. That didn't sound good. No oh, thanks. Really? All that explosion give me away? This does look kind of new. Eh, maybe not. Infinite boxes of uh, non destructibleness. What is that that I'm hearing right here? Is that a ladder or something? Just this. I don't know. shooting at me anyway. You are. I think you're the original person that was shooting at me though. You might be. Oh, damn. I thought I had more health than that. Oh well. Well, I was gonna get us back up to the same spot, and then I realized everything is quite different over here now. I don't know what the hell's going on with that. And that would be a grenade. I was going to get us just mainly to the same spot, but all the enemies have changed. There's a truck here now. Totally different. And they're tossing grenades at me. Not very well, but they are tossing grenades at me. I think the biggest uh, issue I have is that I feel invulnerable in this game and I end up getting myself killed because of it. Looks like one of uh, one of the guys is over here manning a nice big gun. Please tell me that just fell on you. It totally did, didn't it? <laughs> oh yeah. Awesome. So there was one of these guys with uh, the particle gun or whatever it's called, plasma gun. And 
I killed him from afar with a sniper rifle, and then I realized everything was different, so I was like, oh, I guess I should start recording. Sometimes you just can't tell. I was like, did I go a different way or something? No, this is, this is definitely the same spot. Just no shield generators anymore. Hey, bud. Good use of that weapon. What, uh, what happened to the other guys that you had here? It's like they all perished or something. Now at least one of you is good at his job. Alright, so... Hey. That's, uh, something I have apparently missed a lot. So, I imagine that, um... Now that we have, uh... So many powers, and it looks like full powers, that whatever I am capable of getting in these towns should be uh, something I should be able to get right now. Which means I'm not going to get any jumping powers, which is too bad, but I do have the uh, capability to run fast. So I should be able to get over to the gold that I've seen before. I just don't quite know um, how I'm supposed to do it. That's my biggest issue right now. I'll be back in just a second. Anyone got any good ideas to keep your mouth uh, or your throat from getting dry while you're doing this kind of stuff? Because, god damn, I get uh, lots of nice coughs out of doing this. <laughs> Alright. Let's see, I wonder if it would be a good idea to just kind of leave this on most of the time. So I can actually see if there's uh, anything out here that I've been missing. I don't think that there really is that much. That's a grenade. This really doesn't use up much of the uh, power either, so I'm going to keep it on for quite a while. And there's a lot of these things to refill too. Not to mention the speed is really nice. Well, I've definitely already been here and already dealt with that. So I don't think there's any reason to remain there. It doesn't look like it gives me any access to a, uh, a roof or anything like that. This is this door. The guy that was in here is gone now. I know this gives me uh, roof access, but I don't know that it will give me access to anything new. Unless there's just like another side that I need to fall down. Whoops! Didn't mean to fall down like that, but okay. But I was gonna say, unless there's like a side that I need to fall down so I can actually get into uh, some area. I still don't think that there's anything in there, necessarily. But it does have breakable windows. So part of me does wonder if there's anything in there. Like maybe you could jump to the window in such a way that you can get inside. Um, okay, if I was going to be able to get inside, this is it. And it's not helping me, and there's nothing in here anyway. Okay, I've definitely proven that there's nothing there. As far as I'm concerned. Yeah, the main thing that this is probably going to show me is if there is uh, ladders that I've missed throughout the town. This is just where that guy was saying that he'd pay back the dude later. Lots of nothing in this town. Sorry guys, didn't mean to squish you on my way down. Unintentional destruction of property of the Veil creatures. I'm about ready to give up on trying to find too much more gold. I 
probably won't. Nothing from up here that I can get to. Yep, pretty much have everything. At least that I know of. Now this one I remember being kind of odd because uh, I got to the end here and there was nowhere else to go as far as I could tell which was kind of weird. Because this area feels like it should be accessing something else. Seriously, I just, I just touched that guy. Why did that happen? I mean, can I get over to there somehow? I really don't think so. That's gonna end up making me fall down there. Hmm. Alright, forget this. This is not getting me anywhere. No important reasons to do that. There's a strange dust pile there. You on my side? You're not glowing. Strange that the veil power would be able to differentiate. You look like you could use some help. Not good. You guys better back off. I wouldn't do that if I were you. It's not my fault. I totally warned them. Totally warned them. Uh, not this. Nor that. Anyone else alive over here? No? Okay. Well, figured I might as well use this since there is some... Um... Oh, that's what that dust pile is. They get so bloated that they eventually just pop out of existence. But yeah, I figured I would use this gun since there was uh, one on the ground. Anyway, let's see if these guys have anything new to say. Welcome back, BJ. Good work at the church. You damn right it was. Your latest success has really impressed everyone here. Some agents have even asked if they could go on missions with you. <laughs> but Caroline won't let them. I don't think she completely trusts you yet, but she will soon. Sure, whatever, bud. Sorry, I can't talk right now. Hey, Caroline. Haven't seen you in a while. You're either lucky or insane to dodge death the way you do. But welcome back. We tracked some parts from the device you destroyed to an abandoned cannery in Eisenstadt. I need you to do some reconnaissance there. That's all, BJ. Oh, I should tell you that recruitment in the circle is up, and your exploits are a big part of that. So you have my thanks. So that guy upstairs was wrong, and you're actually starting to trust me? Good to know. We're moving the safe house and need to get going. BJ, you need to get to the cannery. Where are you moving it to exactly? Please uh, make sure you let me know so that I can actually find you guys. 
Not that I really need you guys, you don't really sell me anything, but you do give me missions, which is kind of nice. If you survive out there, try not to lead the enemy back to the new hideout. What, did I lead them back to this hideout? Keep an eye out for information about a group called the Golden Dawn. They're either scholars, or crazy, or both. Uh, I'd say scholars, mainly. That was interesting. Why did that fog up like that? I'm too busy to talk right now. Sure you are. Alright, let's see here. I kind of wonder if there are any mission givers out there. I see the black market, but nothing else. Can I just flip over to the other one? Yes, I can. Golden Dawn right there. Um, I do not see any further quest givers at the moment. And that's just west and east, so nothing more to see there. I've almost got all the intel. I don't know where the rest of it is, but uh, it's somewhere out there. It's 1 and uh, 12 that we're missing. But who knows where those are because they're spread out into uh, very strange areas in this place. Anyway, uh, returning to the safe house, Golden Dawn. We also have to uh, speak with Golden Dawn agent about the hostage's location. Is there a reason that I didn't do that? I don't know. <laughs> I must have forgot to do it along the way. So I guess we're heading back to the Golden Dawn at this point. Caught up in doing the stuff all at once and forget to do one thing or another along the way. It happens. Good luck out there, PJ. Sure. Is there is there a way to reload this thing? Like, can I just plug it into a wall? That would be kind of uh, an interesting way to do this. Just kind of plug it into a wall or something. All right. Uh, can I? Hello. I think I may have been over here, but let's double check that. Yeah, this looks awfully familiar. Nothing doing, eh? All right. Well, if there's not going to be much of anything around here, no reason to be here. I'm guessing that there's probably a way to get the gold that I saw by hopping off of a, uh, a roof like that. Seems like the uh, most logical method. Hi! I did it! I'm alive! This son of a bitch came in wanting money, but I refused. He threatened to take me in for questioning. He drew his gun, and I fought back. Just like you do, BJ. I took the gun and killed him. Ha! Let the Nazis come. They don't frighten me anymore. Awesome job, dude. Just making sure. Well, I guess uh, I am really making an impression on the town because uh, before this guy was, I'm pretty sure, being held at gunpoint. And I saved him that time. I don't know if it's the same guy, but he was definitely a guy that was in here. Your face heals awfully fast. Watch this one. He might come back to life. Crazy Nazis and their magical thingies. Coming back to life when they shouldn't. Alright, um... Hmm. How does one get up there? Like this? At first the resistance fighters... That man is a spy! Move up! Did not know that they were going to uh, be talking, nor that they were... Uh, enemies or I wouldn't have come around that corner so fast I would have listened to them <laughs> 